Dr. Michael Landry said that of all the people who could have been working on a project such as LIGO, he believes that LIGO pre-selected Optimus. You have to be a natural optimist to try to detect wavelength and changes in wavelength at the level of one ten thousandths of the size of a proton. As a former state legislator, I say, you, say to you, you have to be an optimist to ask for state government funding for an astronomically based education project in Eastern Washington. Michael Landry and Amber Strunk, the outreach director for LIGO asked me two years ago to help them acquire state funding to build the LIGO Education Center. My wife Jennifer and I organized the legwork for the advocacy effort in Olympia. Most importantly, we arranged appointments with 27 key legislators of both political parties to introduce the LIGO Education Center concept. Our target date to be in Olympia was February 6. Joining Dr. Landry, Amber Strunk, and myself was Dr. Ray Weiss, one of the three inventors of the LIGO facility, as well as being a Nobel recipient. Our job was to inform and persuade the legislature of the educational value of LIGO when most of the legislators had no idea of what a laser interferometer gravitational wave observatory was or even did. We plan to highlight LIGO's groundbreaking discoveries and plans for an educational center. Then lightning struck. I was told to report for jury duty that same week. Would I even be able to make the political introductions? Luckily, or should I say optimistically, all of the constellations aligned. I was not selected to go to court that week. Instead, we packed and headed ourselves up and we headed to Olympia, where our fierce foursome covered much ground at the Capitol with breakneck speed. In the lead of our LIGO Center education charge, even though he was 20 years or more older than the rest of us, was Dr. Rice Weiss. Together, we spent a day and a half in Olympia, met with 149 legislators, and made office visits to 27 of the key legislators and senators who had authority over the budget. As can be seen today, success is evidenced by groundbreaking for the LIGO Observatory STEM Exploration Center. Thank you for the opportunity to be involved in securing the $7.7 .7 million of funds for this optimistic project. I look forward to the day when hundreds of students of all ages will be motivated to learn more about our universe because of the inspiration and education they received at the LIGO Hanford Observatory STEM Exploration Center. This groundbreaking is an exciting event for LIGO and for the state of Washington.